So we're almost closing down to a year since I've done my first video review on True Classic Tees. And in this one, I'm gonna answer all your questions because I've been getting a lot, as well as show you how they held up so far. Let's go. So first things first, what happened to the discount code? It's no longer working. Yes, there was some issues with that and now the new code is AS10. So I'll leave the link as well as the code down in the description. Now as for how well the shirts are holding up, I'll show you. As you guys can see the t-shirt, you know, it's still not drab. It's retained its shape pretty well. There's no bacon collar or pilling. And this is coming from someone who didn't take, you know, any extra care measures when doing the laundry. And you know, the fit is still on point. Now, how much has it shrunk or does it even shrink? Yes, the first couple of washes, it does shrink a bit, but not to the point where it shrinks a couple of sizes down. And I am getting, I'm getting weight again, which is terrible, but you know, the shirts still fit me pretty damn well, especially in the arms. Now, what are my stats and what size did I get? Now, I am 5'10 and currently 188-ish pounds and went with a medium. I get a lot of comments regarding on what size to choose based on their height and weight. And to make things easier, go to the website. They have a size calculator where you can go off your stats and choose the fit you are looking for. Next question, is the shirt 100% cotton? Uh, no, it's not. It's something that I missed in the first video review as well. It is 60% cotton and 40% jersey polyester, which explains why they retain their shape and durability much longer compared to, you know, plain cotton tees at your local Target, Costco, Gap, and whatnot. Now, after almost a year, would I still recommend True Classic Tees? Given the amount of time they've lasted and are still part of my, you know, very casual wardrobe, Yes, I would suggest giving them a try if you are in the market for, you know, some basics. Also, based on the comments from my last video, many of the viewers also recommended them. They were happy, you know, they gave them a try. And, for, and if for some reason they don't work out for you, their customer service will take care of you for a refund. I know there are a lot of t-shirt companies out there, but none are doing what True Classic Tees are doing, uh, which is providing, you know, housing for homeless vets through their tiny house project in Savannah, Georgia. I think that's pretty damn cool, really. Now, they are not very transparent about this or just blow it up in their marketing all the time, but they are doing great things behind just selling t-shirts. So I think that's something, you know, to commend during these like really crazy times right now. But yeah, that was a quick little update review on True Classic Tees. And I also forgot to mention that this is not a sponsored review. True Classic Tees did not reach out to me to do an update video. They didn't reach out to me to do anything for them, okay? Uh, link and everything will be down in the description below. And I hate to do the YouTube thing, like say, oh guys, make sure to like, subscribe, comment, but please, please, please guys, anything helps this channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.